Today's topic is Chromatin Organization. DNA is held together by histone and non-histone chromosomal proteins, which are collectively known as chromatin. A human cell is made up of 46 chromosomes. If those chromosomes are stretched and joined end to end, they could reach up to 2 meters. But the nucleus has a very small space to hold such long chromosomes. So, it is obvious that chromatins needs to be highly condensed in order to be placed inside the nucleus. Chromatin appears as a series of 11 nanometer beads which are wrapped by DNA of approximately 200 nucleotides. Each bead with associated DNA molecule is known as nucleosome, the unit of chromatin. The nucleosomes on the DNA chain is called beads on a string structure. If one nucleosome core particle is subjected to dissociation with increasing salt concentration, we will get a octameric histone core protein and a 147 base pairs double-stranded DNA. This 147 base pairs long DNA wrap 1.7 times around the histone core proteins. The octameric structure of core histones were suggested by Roger Conbarge in 1974. H2A, H2B, H3 and H4. These are four types of histone proteins, each of which is present in pair to form the octameric structure of the histone core. It shows the 3D conformation of the nucleosome core particles. Each of the core histone protein contains an N-terminal tail and a histone fold region. All eight N-terminal tails protrude from the core structure they provide binding site for several other proteins. Every nucleosome has 142 hydrogen bonds between the DNA and the histone core. The 80 rich minor groove of DNA binds with the arginine and lysine residues on the histone core proteins. These amino acids are positively charged so that they can tightly bind to the negatively charged DNA. The outer side of the minor groove of DNA is GC rich. Another important factor is an additional histone that is often present in a 1 is to 1 ratio with nucleosome cores known as H1. Each H1, which is also called linker histone, binds to each nucleosome, contacts both DNA and protein and changes the path of DNA as it exits from the nucleosome. Nucleosomes are arranged in a complex zigzag structure known as 30 nanometer chromatin fiber. These fibers further form 300 nanometer loops. This is the general overview of chromatin organization.